Medical in um, St. Martin Medical Center. He have a bullet lodged in his brain. St. Martin to entertain St. Martin people, right? Knowing that they is gang affiliated with the sex gang, right? This is not a business beer. The man they want to kill me on the road. We're going to move the restaurant to deal. Yeah. Mona Road, we're getting too much fight. That's surprising stuff. Really? They, they don't appreciate Joe and Scatter. They don't appreciate us as local artists. You know what I mean? Bad. Brother, oh, I'm back dance hall. Oh, I'm back sting. Oh, I'm back clash. So, oh, some man I said they want to be the best. Oh, some man I said they want to be number one. And they not clash with nobody. I have my beast. I have about seven car. I'm virgin. I have car. I'm not finished PFR. What me first friend of J.A.? But here we go now. As me, me just said, take it off our internet, because here we go on. It's a situation with you and him sensitive, you know. And, it, and him hang him hurt, you know, you have to look for it. Viewers, subscribers, what go on? Big up on yourself, my people. Hope everybody good. You see what I say? Big up to all our new viewers, all our new subscribers. If you're there a long time, respect said we. You see it? As I say, we step in and know, so we have a couple of things to talk about as usual, people. So with that, see where two artists is said to have been shot, people. You see what I say? One of them is so serious that him in a coma right now with a bullet in him head. And we are talk about dance all artists. We are going to look into what go on there. So people, we also see where... You know, busy signal, blast, some face and Joe and scatter for being unprofessional. We are gonna look into that as well, my people. We also see where my father artist J A responded to footer hype. You see it and abon him out as bad mind. We also see where another elder a blast footer hype as bad mind as well, people. We are gonna look into that. We also have you know vibes cartel keys finale. We have the update as to when we are gonna get the you know, showdown and vibes cartel case and know what is what at the moment, people. We also have some updates as it relates to Spice. We see where Beanie Man, you know, is exposing that he's getting big fight at his restaurant and me have to, you know, move the restaurant. We also see where Javi Ambassador has been hailed as one of the best producers, my people. And we see where a producer you know, get cross and angry at the state of dancehall currently, people. So, do the right thing, subscribe to the channel and also click the notification bell. You must wonder how me get so much thing for talk about all the time, people. Not even me no know either, you see. But anyways, make we go into it, my people. Hey, my people, starting out this block with the artists, them that we get to understand that got shot up, people. Yeah, we are talk about some Trinidad artists in a, you know, a dancehall them do still, you see what I mean, I say? Talented youth, them said we are dance all them do, but you don't know we get to understand that, you know, them fly go St. Martin for a show and look like a show don't go on and man get caught up, you see it? But them youths, I may mean, observe them for a while, people, and it seems as if them need to decide if them are deal with badness or music, you see what I mean, I say? Yeah, man, a couple of them message drop out well, you see it? Some say, them say six and some say... Them say seven, yes, so when I say people, it's a bag of thing I go on, and it seems as if it's pan outside of the music. Now, as it relates to the whole shooting up still, people, I am not sure, you know, what are the motive we establish for what go on, people, you see what I say, but in the street, man, I point fingers here and there, but me are not police, so the police have actually sought out that. However, we that see where a uh, youth from what the six camp where go by the name K Man Six, you know, him seems to be at odds with them youth that we get sh shot, you see it? And him put up a status where he's basically reacting to the situation and he's saying that when men shoot me or when man shoot me, they're matrini, so they're right away, people. When man sh or when man shoot me, like him, I said the last time man shoot him, thousand man gone live, boasting and bragging. A man make a whole video and drop it a day after, you see it, and basically he must say, you know, this life is not fear, hence the reason why you never laugh at an next man downfall, you see it, so that would be in reaction to the whole thing we go on, you see, because as I say, it would be serious thing, one of the artists them in a coma at this moment, and that artist go by the name Pump. Plumpy boss, you see it? And we get to understand that they must say a next one here, Meds boss, got shot as well. So I don't know how true that is this, but we can confirm that Plumpy boss actually got shot. And the reason why we can confirm that people with a serious mother, I say right now, 
him in a coma in a St. Martin and it's, it look like they might have some trouble with the whole health system over there in terms of giving him proper treatment and so forth. You see it? So we are going to make take a listen at what his mother is saying, people. Very serious thing. Check this out. Hospital in um, St. Martin Medical Center. He have a bullet lodged in his brain. They say they was to fly him to France. But in as much as how he's not a citizen of your whole country, Medicare do not cover him. He don't have no health insurance over there. So they're trying to see the way forward to get him airlifted back to Port of Spain here yeah, so that they could do the surgery to save his life. But right now he's in, in a medically induced coma because the bullet is lodged in his brain. Now with that, Mr. Emmanuel, I think you do have a message uh, that you would like to get to the Prime Minister. Uh, what would that message be? Can tell I that you were like very Prime passionate. I would like Prime Minister to wave that health care policy all they have in, in St. Martin. Because at the end of the day, my son didn't come to St. Martin to break nobody house, to rob nobody, to kill nobody. He comes to St. Martin to entertain St. Martin people, right? Knowing that they is gang affiliated with the sex gang, right? He still take a chance and he come to entertain them, right? My child lie down in St. Martin Hospital where he have no health care, where he have no insurance to be medically taken care of properly. I'm calling on you all, Prime Minister, your Health Minister, your Director of Public Prosecution, your Commissioner of Police, whoever, to take it upon themselves to make sure my child get the surgery that he need in St. Martin. If that is in France or Guadeloupe, they say the healthcare thing, or they don't have no neurosurgeon, but since St. Martin know that that center don't have no new. Why they didn't look to airlift the boy? They still tell him about the care do nothing because he's not a citizen and he don't have no health care insur insurance for St. Martin. He for Trinidad. Trinidad government would have seen about all the citizens and set them back nice and in perfect order. Unless God say, well, he expire. You understand? So why St. Martin government can't do the same courtesy? I mean, just said the boy didn't come over in all the country to commit no crime. He come to entertain all the people. The party name keep up that. That is the biggest shoe he have out right now. And that is all they're going to do, my child, St. Martin people. That is all they're going to do, my child. People want to hear that from a grieving mother. You see, it sounds very serious. And, you know, probably if she did a talk on that tone in front of my youth, he would have known, say, yo, the bad man thing now going to really work, especially if you find yourself with a talent to see it because at the end of the day you don't know the crew and the link and everybody did there when everything is good but right now are your family them left here in a you know worries and problem i wonder if you have got to drop out and support people so as me say you know as where joshi would have said nice nice song artist are artist and bad man are bad man so they want them have to decide if a music them a deal with are a badness because if a music would not deal with you don't have to get to yourself in line for the music side but if a badness not deal with just know say every man we are deal with badness are got dead that's just so you think you see it and we can see where this whole badness thing and the music thing kind of narrow especially if you're a man we have to go because we don't see even artists where have arguably the biggest song in a dance hall at this moment and we can't see them on a stage show because of that type of energy there. So as I said, the man they have to know exactly what they are doing, yeah, people. That's all I have to say. But, you know, hopefully the artist recover still. You see it? Yeah, man. Hopefully he recover. But it's serious with them youth, yeah. You see it? As I see, say, it kind of forward, gone out of the music, gone in the street business. But anyway, people, we have a number of things to talk about. But I want to reason more upon that. But we have to move on. So yes, my people, we have some confirmation as it relates to Vibes Cartel. We get to understand that you know, the judgment surrounding Vibes Cartel will be handed down on July the 31st. I see what I say? Yeah, man. Wednesday, July the 31st, 2024 at 2 p.m. sharp, people. You see what I say? Yeah, man. A that a go on for what a go on as it relates to Vibes Cartel. According to Nationwide News, they are saying that they understand that the Court of Appeal will hand down the long-awaited judgment on Vibes Cartel appeal this Wednesday. July 31st, 2024, the judgment will determine whether Cartel and his three co-accused, Sean Storm Campbell, Kyra Jones and Andre St. John, will be ordered to stand trial again 
for the murder of Clive Lizard Williams are be acquitted in the matter, people. You see, it's a data go on for what I go on. You see, and it, as we say, it can go both ways. Me see where it's stronger upon the side of vibe start uh, going free still, but at the end idea, you never can tell. You see, it, uh, me and on a last color, so me do know this last thing for no absolute space so, or where we can speak on it with no overall viewpoint. You see, it, me just, I just I try to pick sense out of nonsense and based on how me view it, you know, as me say, lean to the side eh, more stronger. But nonetheless, a Jamaica this way I talk about and so forth. So we see how it play out. And when it comes down to Vibes Cartel people, when me really look on it and create, me see say, yo, it's a very skilled artist because me I look on and I say, yo, the man remain relevant and, you know, never seems to last a day outside a dance hall, even though he was incarcerated or is still incarcerated people. And, you know, when me really look on it, that is not really a normal thing to do. Well, for this, like, past week, at the quietest me ever see, like, Vibes Cartel in a dance hall. It's like, you know, I just a fingers crossed moment at this moment, you see it. So when we even check, like, Vibes Cartel IG, we normally the update with a bag of things are going on. You know, it's like I just a couple music promotion and them thing there. Nothing, no form of talking or them type of thing there, you see. But at the end of the day, people, we see how it goes, you see. It. So that is that. And speaking of Five Cartel, we have some news as it relates to Spice as well. So good news to, you know, the Spice Nation, the best tick camp. But that's where Spice managed to secure a goal selling record in a canada people you see it will finally see where some like it has uh, sold about forty thousand units in a canada and that would be equated to a goal and that would be spy's first solo single way to achieve that you know level of success and also with a thing i think she had like some like it will sell goal in a canada as well and platinum i think so that is definitely a good look for spices so, so some like it you know goal in a canada definitely a good look and based on what we did see you know in terms of us it'll take it time a chuckle so probably it will sell goal in a us which would be a much you know larger bragging rights because at the end of the day that would be about five hundred thousand units for sell goal in a us so you know, big up to Spice for that achievement still. You see, when I say achievement, is an achievement nonetheless. And from a put in the work and you achieve something, you're supposed to feel proud of yourself. So that is that, people. Anyways, so that's we're another super top superstar where we're not really put in a our conversation for a daily boy here, people. But when you check it, you know, I'm rank up in the Sean Paul Shaggy, you know, them type of artists, them Mr. Vegas and them type of artists, they when it come on a rural level people. And we are talk about busy signal. So we see busy signal on a recent interview on TVG, I think Anthony Miller people. And you know, <laughs> the Anthony Miller asked him about some face and so forth. And him said the reason why he hasn't done some face over the years is the level of unprofessionalism. You see what I say? And he's saying that when it come on to local acts, him not think them treat local acts with the respect where them treat international acts with that's what i say people and that is what busy signal i say and busy signal i say him take him own i see that and him would I see where you know the international acts has never done better than the you know local acts in a jamaica on a performance basis so him feel like respect you and him would I give more reason why so you can't take a listen at it. personally i don't think Reggae Sumfest and the whole staff knows how to treat an artist. And when I said an artist, I'm talking local artists. That's surprising stuff. They, they don't appreciate Joe and Scatter. They don't appreciate us as local artists. You know what I mean? I've seen the I've seen the treatment that an international artist got. You know what I mean? Name one Sumfest. Or even before Sumfest, before me born when I was a little toddler. Name one Sun Splash. That an international artist outdo a local artist. There's none. But be specific. That how did things fall apart? What happened specifically? I've been approached by Joe Bogdanovich many times, you know, in terms of doing something. I guess his staff and the people who claim they know stuff, it, it, it's just garbage. Big, 
garbage. One specific time was, uh, the last time I did Subfest was, uh, I don't remember the year, but I had a contract. I had a contract for an hour set. And on the stage, I think I was there reaching us, you know, maybe I think it was 17 minutes in my performance. Some guy was on the side of the stage showing me a time, like, hey, like, Every time I look to the side, I see someone hitting the time and saying, you know, they got to rush me off to put a different artist on or, or sometimes it's pushed back. So it's unprofessional. You know what I mean? I'm used to professionalism worldwide. You know what I mean? I, I'm just coming from the summer job. Pudo, Pudo, so the people that is busy signaling or busy signal are uh, make it known that, you know, as a top international star, in a dance hall, he would have got boom and you know, bargain for some fest to get an hour with a performance as where he used to around the world. And by the time he reached 17 minutes for him performance, a man who have to usher him off a stage to put on other artists and everything. You see it? And he's saying that them the thing they not go on for certain other stage to around the world. So, you know, him have to deal with film thing on a level. That is the reason why him not really touches her. I don't know one thing still, people. But tell me what you think. Leave one of the thoughts in the comments. Section. Next up, we'll see where Beanie Man and, you know, not really on the artist level, on the business side. We don't know Beanie Man had a restaurant called Sima that was named after one of them recent albums. You see what I say? Restaurant are going good and so forth, you know, for a while. But you don't know upon a day to day, we're not going to really keep an eye on that. But, you know, recently I get some updates as it relates to the restaurant. And it seems like, you know, there is some issues there. I don't know what exactly, but being it would have exposed that a little fight are going round the thing, my people. You see what I say? And he will have to relocate the restaurant at another location my people take a quick listen at what the doctor say and probably you if he's a fan of beanie man and you normally a circulate all them places there and love that spot there and whatever you can get an update from this if you haven't seen the live stream that beanie man did so check this out and listen what the doctor say my people this is not a business beers the man they want to kill me on the road Stop now. Nobody knows I'm not having something. Just, oh God, Jesus Christ. No. Oh God. Alright, let's go back again tonight. We find a new location for um, Sima Restaurant. Sima Restaurant will be a check and vibe production at the studio, my studio. Afghan Sense Spring Road, you know where Shocking Vibe is. We're gonna move the restaurant to deal. Yeah. Mona Road, we're getting too much fight. We're getting fight from everybody. We're getting fight from everywhere, everything. Is it? So, yeah. Makes sense. You put it somewhere where everybody loves it and everything. So, people. All my fans and well wishers and everybody who love the food and everything, we are going to move the restaurant from Mona Road to Shocking Vibe Production. Please, just understand. And trust me, don't worry about it. Don't worry about what cost it, nah, nothing. Got nothing to cost it. There's no war. There's no violence. There's nothing. We just need a bigger space. And we need somewhere to open so people can come there and relax themselves. We have no parking there. We have nowhere to park the cars and, and, and anything. So we have no right now to everybody know that. We are going to be a shocking vibe. Blessings. Love you all. This is being a man. And I'm out. Rasta. Beloved. Thank you. Yeah, my people, I'm not deal with the girls them sugar, so no no say I girls them sugar that and you know the man have a restaurant and respect you. I'm not deal with the things of my people. But that is what the king of the answer be the man is saying, my people. So let me hear on the thoughts in the comment section. You see what I say? Yeah man, but you know, hope him just sort out him thing and get a better spot as he is 
saying my people and him thing work out said way. Cause you don't know a progress. Anyways, people, that's the way Governor Heal Javi Ambassador as one of the top producers in uh, Jamaica. You see, this is where you know Javi Ambassador has made some progressive mood in move, including you know keeping a recent sold out stage show as well people and you don't know governor passed through as to St. Catherine natives and you know as we say governor would have, have some stuff to say as it relates to Javi you know saying that him love how him a role you know love how him even as the bigger producer does step back and make some other little youth around him and eat a food and them thing they said we as eat so he is saying that you know him love the energy from strength to strength and, and all of them thing there so take a quick listen at this and make we move on mm. Listen, Nathan. Pick up myself, I'm proud of you. Yeah, man, you're my best manager that I ever see for a boy. You gotta do it right, you see me? Yeah, you see, I take the black seat and make beer youth around out. We, there, Falcon, beer youth. And I must be a getter youth. And I come with a native of St. Catherine, because I know I ride across the bridges of a punish down my forward track. Oh, wow. So, I feel good and I feel proud, you see. And next St. Catherine native I do it. So, I am here for Jackie. Play the next one on the side. Yes, my beautiful people, that is Governor and Javi Ambassador. You see what I say? I don't know. Yeah, man, Javi are doing things that is hard for deny, said we. You see what I say? Yeah, man. And as you know, Javi would have 450 career a deal with, and you see, say, 450 a deal with the road pan a level. You see what I say? I want our best young talent them i want to talent them with us seems to in a film only and always seems to uh, do the right thing uh, without the bag of unnecessary hype and drama and them thing them people so big up to javi ambassador and all of the ones them around javi ambassador said we anyways people moving on with us we are ja you know mavado artist ja basically would uh, respond to footer hype so when I say, even though I'm not called footer hype name, based on what was written, we can see that a footer hype in my talk. So this is what we see on J.A.'s story. And the reason why I'm not have the right to call out foot, um, footer hype, footer hype would have make some utterance directing to J.A. I say, yo, you know, him basically around Mavado for the hype and fame and so forth. Him not really rate Mavado and all of these things. And Mavado is using him for you know, style flex and them thing there. However, J.A. I say a bad mind thing footer there and him just a try to mash up the goalie side energy. So this is what J.A. wrote specifically, people. So he is saying that one thing me know, such man can talk till God come. Hashtag bad mind clearly clear. Well, one the goalie for mash up are the God for mash up. So as them hear about hospitalize them, run out and attack about ancestors with you know some laughing member me not in a such man history but a little success will mad them hashtag bad artist hashtag nato so that is what j a is saying my people you see what i say yeah man so basically he must say yo a mash a uh, bad blood um footer hyper spread in the camp on a site my people i don't know what to think you know and if you make matters worse, people, that's where an elder come out and turn up the stove, turn up the flame even more upon footer hype. <laughs> the man got extreme people. The man say, footer hype are the most bad mind person in uh, Jamaica. You don't have to listen to this and tell me if you don't actually agree with people. Check this out. I bless upon yourself, man. I could talk about bad mind again. I have a born bad mind too. Is the most bad mind person come out of that the land when you're in Jamaica. Bad mind. Bad mind. You get every medal for bad mind. You get gold, you get silver, and you get bronze. You get everything for bad mind. Nobody can go around him. Foot of hype. Foot of hype is the most bad minded person as a young man come out of Jamaica. Yes, it's true. That brother tried to bring down everybody. Everybody. If you do good, he tried to bring it down. And if you do bad, it worse, he bring it down more. What a bad minded brother, man. Yeah, man, I truth, man. He said, he get everything, man. He get the gold, he get the silver, he get the bronze. I mean, I don't know how he get again. But I don't know how much trophy left he get for bad mind. 
I think, brother, I think foot I bring down his mother and his father and his sister and his auntie. Me don't know, forget, forget fame. Because I saw him, I get fame, fame, you know, just to bring down people, bring down people. Oh, God, man. Sometimes it's only like a youth at Jamaica try, like a DJ thing. I don't go on well, you know, man, and people are big them up. You wait till, wait for foot I for come. Wait for him for come. I used to sometimes bad mind not work, you know, because sometimes when him try for bad mind, you youth them and talk all kind of bad things about them. Instead of them go down, then go further, then lift up further. Because I know foot that run earth, you know, a God, a God rule heaven and earth. But if you check yourself, man, man can't bad mind some man. Eh? Both man and woman, that brother try to bring down everybody. Everybody. And if you hear in talk anything good about one, and the least little thing happen, you switch. If you pain, feel uplift them. When you uplift a, 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 a little brother in a him feels, man, or the people of Jamaica, when you uplift them, you feel pain. But if you put them down, it's a pleasure. It's a joy. Virgin, I wonder if you can sleep at night time. The amount of a, a, a youth where you try to bring down in a Jamaica, especially in the music field, man. Sometimes like a youth them try and hear people talk about them so nice and people are trying to big them up and when for the hype come negative, 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 negative. Look who's about Nigel Boy reach. You remember what you had to try to do to Nigel Boy manager? Talk about him and a fish and him and a dot and you know, play him Nigel Boy music again and this and that and that. You see, Nigel Boy gone left you. You can't stop Nigel Boy and the manager again. And the one thing me I say, the one thing me I say, Nigel Boy just that. The man, the manager go live in a plane like that, then one plane because the world want him. So for the hype, this is a bad mind to work. You try to bring down the youth because you talk about the manager fish and him and this and that and all kind of things and if I manage that they have to stop playing music. You see when God do something you can't turn it back. When the thing with God in you can't turn it back young man. But if you look into yourself man. You can't use bad mind for make money man. And try to put down everybody. I feel... So yeah, my people, as my, you don't hear what the elder deal with and what the elder say. That is where the man has said people. You see it. So but in terms of like put us still, you know, in terms of like him say are the most bad mind people in a Jamaica. Yeah, a lot of people did they were beat foot us still. But at the end of the day, you know, me understand the elder from his perspective and so forth. In my view, still a lot of people in my foot are hype, but no, him not really wrong still, you see what I say. Mm, but in an evening, Nigel Boy case, that was a case where, you know, uh, uh, we understand that him and Dr. Love are going at it for years. But, you know, probably people that look on it and say time and place, there is a time and place for everything. And probably him, a bona fire upon Dr. Love at that time was like the wrong timing because I want to look on and I say Nigel Boy, I look for getting breakthrough. And a lot of people like Nigel Boy, I want to see him win. And to say, well, I'm talented. You see what I mean? I say. So the fact that a uh, Anama City has got stir up the so between the manager and whatever, you know, that I uh, got spark a negative conversation where nobody not really want. You see it and people probably look upon it and say, well, they are trying to stop the youth. So, you know, if outsiders were just now study the thing on a daily basis, just a look upon it from the level and I say, you're a bad mind, I understand, you see it. Yeah, man. But that are that still people. Tell me one thing. And just to wrap up the whole thing, people, that's where non-change entertainer, popular producer non-change entertainer is, you know, establishing how boring dance hall is. The man said to all the thing boring right now, him is a, you know, even though him is a businessman and a producer, him also dwelling at the artist business. Him not get the big break yet, but right now, him would have go bust off a boy head musically over sting right now. He is saying that him call out even version and version are going like say him want to go around the thing. He is saying that version rich, him rich, you know, and so forth. So version don't really have much levels of vibe. I don't know how not change talk up him thing them all the while the people. But in terms of him saying that the dance hall space is boring and the man him afraid for clash and them thing the people. A fox, you see what I say? Nowadays it look like them man here. 
um, prefer go take gun and shoot them when they're in the street, people, and actually deal with it musically. You see, because even them youths are when me see. Uh, you know, I get shot and all of them things. They probably, if I music it has stem from people, probably they won't even, you know, go take on each other lyrically on a stage and go make some millions of people. You see, but a man ruling for dirt them one end. But make you take a listen to what now changes saying no people. And, you know, close off said we. Check this out. Let me ask my people. But just there, I have burn some incense. And me just there, what a vibe. And me there, I think. I mean, I wonder if I'm me alone see it. Dance all boring, you know? People, dance all boring. I prefer Ninja Man, Cartel, Movada, them days. Them young youth, yeah, them only bad in a song. But when you come to go up on stage and clash, every man turn coward. Every man afraid. All of them, you know, matter which name I want to call. Right now, I'm ready for clash any man. Just see for night. I know when the fan is going say, Oh, Ray, Ray, I left me a dead like dog, brother. Dance all too boring. Sin out of one artist, man. Say something about no change. Say something, man, I could run out for you. Know. Dance all too boring, man. You understand? Say, me if you tell me, say, I reggae some face alone, I go on. Sting is coming up, you know. Sting is coming up. Dance all artists them too. Coward. Tell me if I lie me I tell in the comment section. This is not the dance hall where I grew up and know. This is not the dance hall where me always a see man on stage a clash. Tune for tune. Lyrics for lyrics. Them I know these artists say all things they know about a chap. And who can buy bees. And who can go here B and B. Uh, who can cock up moms? Brother, who are here, man? A clap man past stage, Jod. Who are here, man? A DJ. Word for word. Like Ninja Man and Car tell them, Jod. I don't want a man tell me nothing. They may you to have life too easy. They make a quick money and talk about who that the man is not on my level and this man is not on for them level. Who want to clash in a dance hall? I don't business why no. Promoter want to say. I no business where no vlogger boy want to say. I no business where no body on the street want to say. Dance hall cannot go on without clash. Remember, say a sting, you know. Sting make dance hall nice, you know. And I say my hand and my incense and the ancestors, they might talk to me. You know how these artists them too. Coward. Where the Joshi? Where the Skeng? All I man them say, yo, who no bad? On a lyricist, prove on a point, run out, chop two word pan the track. Wow, I hear BMB alone on a DJ now. I see the phone, you know, on a hand up. They bounce on a friend and chat with one of the artists. Then I hear BMB and chat about one of the artists. I bought for God's stage show and chat about that the artist there. But when you fuck up and put the lyrics them on the rhythm, and this one artist on a coward, on a menke, on a beat. I be a road badness, no 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 lyrics. No 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 clashing on a brain. Road badness. And road badness no business we don't know. We don't want to talk about that the community the bad. Over the so bad. Round the so bad. Brother, we want back dance hall, we want back sting, we want back clash. So all some man I said they want to be the best. All some man I said they want to be number one and they not clash with nobody. You cannot be a true dancehall artist unless you clash. So I don't know who I fool you. Mr. Artist guy. Mr. DJ guy. But until Sting and Mr. Sona clash, well then you know we get my ratings. Differently still, anybody who want to clash me, be up for you. Remember, I call out Virgin and you know, Virgin still like I didn't know. I hear just she call him out here now, so let me see. Because I end the idea. Virgin rich, me rich, me have my business them. You understand? Me then I want my business store. You understand? Me have my beast, me have about seven car. And Virgin have car and I finish PFR. So we can clash. He more back in career and me alone.
So that's a non-change people, you don't know. Big up non-change entertainer. Fox the man attack, you see it. Yeah, man, the place want to shake up. You see it, and the artists, they want to bring back the thing. But a vibe where, you know, it was competitive in a way where, you know, every man uh, just uh, try to prove who are the better dance artists and so forth. Nowadays, the man want to prove that, but it look like kind of real life, street life badness them are dealing with. But big up on yourself and bless up on yourself, you know, my people. You don't know how the thing go. Catching up on another one. Respect our manners. I'm out.